What's up YouTube? It's time for the next mail day. I don't do these on like a set schedule or anything. It's pretty much just whenever I have some things saved up, I'll go ahead and open them. And, you know, not, I think the last mail day was, you know, had a lot more stuff, but I got some packages in the mail. I just checked it and I'm kind of excited to open those. So I'm going to go ahead and do a mail day. This first one is from uh, Jonathan. He is from Massachusetts. It says open first, so that's why I'm going with this one first. Use my trusty little mail opener here that I got last time. <sighs> Woo! Slices that shit right open. All right, make sure nothing else in there. All right, Jonathan. <clears throat> See what we got here. Oh, hello stickers. Got an FMF sticker. Is that a sticker? Is that an MSR sticker? Yeah, MSR sticker. <laughs> That's who makes my mirror, by the way, guys. MSR, TM Design Works. I also have a chain guide from them. Anyways, <clears throat> hey Sumoto, big fan of you. I watch your vids every day and I even watch you in school. Here's a pic of me on my 2014 KX85. I would like for you to follow me on Instagram. It's MXRIPPA120. MXRIPPA120. Gotcha. Also, could you please get 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 some stickers? Please get some stickers. Uh, wait, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> the pictures really throw me off here. Um, please get. Also, could you please get me some stickers? I hope you get to 200,000 subs. Here's some stickers for your bike or helmet. And P.S. I'm 13 years old. <laughs> 200,000 actually hit that the other day, which is pretty exciting. I didn't make a video for it because I didn't have a bunch of just random stuff to throw together like I did for the 100,000 video. So, yeah, um, I'm at 200,000 subs, guys. Thank you. Brabs for days, by the way. Thank you, Jonathan. Awesome. Moving right along. Uh, this one's from Jacob T. Reynolds. I recognize the name from... Uh, social media I do actually pay attention to you guys names so yes that one definitely sounds familiar he's from Kentucky oh see what we got here is that it yep that is it homie sent me his graduation hell yeah congratulations dude I wish I had a supermoto when I was in high school that shit Oh my god, life would have been so much different if I had the fucking WR back in high school. Got some more FMF stickers there. What's up, Subi? I've seen you stuff before. Figured I'd send you a graduation announcement because I have some extra ones and need to do something with them. I don't blame you. It's not like you want those hanging around. Anyway, big fan of the videos. Wish I had the guts to wheelie like you can. On uh, front is... <coughs> Sorry, guys. I'm kind of... My allergies are fucking me. Anyways, on front is my DRZ400. Thought it was a fitting prop for graduation photos. Anyways, ride safe and keep up the good work. Jacob. Dude, these graduation announcements are way better than mine. Mine fucking sucked. You get your motorcycle and shit on your... God, high school. I do not miss high school, by the way, guys. <clears throat> awesome. Thank you, Jacob. Thank you. I appreciate that. Congratulations on graduating as well. That's always... Life seems to get much more exciting after you graduate. And I don't know. Just being an adult is pretty fucking cool. Got my own crib here with my girlfriend. It's pretty dope. Uh, this next one is from the House of Masks. And I actually had to look him up on Instagram. Whenever I saw that I got this in the mail, like the next day he commented on Instagram saying that he like dropped me something in the mail. And <clears throat> this dude's fucking talented. He, yeah, you guys should go definitely check out the House of Masks on Instagram. He's also got a YouTube channel, so, you know, go check out all that shit. He also rides scooters and whatnot. <laughs> all right, let's see here. Hold on. Well, there's lots of stuff. Oh, hell yeah, this is fucking dope. Kind of get my stuff going here, spread out so we can all see it. <laughs> I was checking out this one on Instagram too, the guy that made this. I can't remember his name now, but he does like these little South Park characters. 
pretty fucking dope. <clears throat> These are going up on the fridge. Those are dope. Those are all magnets. Hell yeah. Not that one, but those two. <coughs> hmm. <laughs> Anyways, these are dope. These are fucking dope. <laughs> this is what that dude looks like, seriously. Anyways, all right, to the letter. Subi, what is up, man? Uh, my name is AJ Good, and I own the House of Masks. Basically a horror museum up here in Ohio. I'm giving you some stickers from the house. I would basically say that I am the you of the horror world. <laughs> Hope you put them to good use. Feel free to check my shit out on Instagram, which I already said that I already did. Uh, me and my girl rat out some little 50cc scooters, you know, ride them like we stole them. I noticed that as well. That's the only fucking way to ride the scooters. <clears throat> uh, I also tattoo, so I threw in an I Hate AJ Good sticker. They have basically become my business cards. Anywho, you're the man and for sure my favorite moto vlogger. If you ever hit Ohio, hit me up for some free tattoo work. If you guys haven't noticed, I my whole stomach is tattooed and some down my legs. You can kind of see one creeping out of my, my UGG there. I got lots of tattoos. Y'all, lots more on the way as well. The shop info is on the back of the card included. All right. P.S. The South... The South Park face stickers are my character from the House of Masks. Told you, check that shit out on Instagram. <laughs> All right, thank you, AJ. That's fucking dope. Um, seriously, guys, go check out his stuff on Instagram because it, it's really fucking cool. Get all these up piled up here together so I don't fucking lose anything. Oh, shit. Son of a bitch. Oh yeah, did I mention scooters? My little group, uh, all ride 50 cc's. The Scooter Squad. That's pretty fucking hilarious. Scooter Squad. That's funny. This one's for sure going up on the toolbox. <laughs> scooters are fun. Scooters are definitely fucking dope. It doesn't matter what you're riding. It's about the ride. Moving right along. This one's from uh, Devin. He's in Ohio. Or she. I guess it could be a she. I don't know. Devin. I've, I've seen that name go both ways. I mean, my name is Tori. It's typically a female name. So, whatever. <coughs> Dear Subi. What's good? My name is Devin Flat. Uh, I've been watching your videos for a long time. I'm 14 years old. And I live in the city of Dayton in Ohio. I'm planning to get a scholarship for baseball. You you replied to one of my comments when I asked you to post more. You were <laughs> mad, but it made my day. I wanted to ask you, do you or did you play sports? If so, what sports? What places do you plan to vacation? I actually just got back from Colorado last night, and here I am the next day recording this. So Colorado, that was the little vacation for me and the girlfriend. We did some mountain hiking. I'm going to California here at the end of June, beginning of July. So I'll be in San Francisco around then. So, you know, if my California homies, I'll be out that way. Um, I know I might be asking a lot, but I don't have any money because I just started my job. But could you send me a sticker or something? I work at a place called Kroger's. Oh shit, Kroger's like the big grocery store here too in Texas, so I know what that's about. Um, Kroger's now only have to be 13 to work there. Damn, I don't think you can be 13 to work at the Kroger's here, but I admire the ambition. Um, <clears throat> uh, yeah, uh, only have to be 13 to work here, but all I could do is bag, but thanks, bro, and keep up the good work. <coughs> Sorry guys, I'm having trouble breathing. Uh, sorry for the, uh, bad handwriting. Uh, that's okay. My handwriting sucks ass anyways. Um, <clears throat> also doesn't help that I'm in the fucking dark in here trying to read, <laughs> read pencil. But, um, do I play sports? Um, whenever I was growing up, I played hockey. I played soccer when I was like super young, but 
that was like everybody plays soccer i feel like so mostly hockey i did one semester of lacrosse uh yeah um other than that like i used to ride bmx and do that kind of shit which you know i'll probably get another bike and dabble dabble in some bmx again that shit's always fun i have a mountain bike now um and there's a nature preserve on the back side of where i live so yeah i don't know um those are those are about my sports. Baseball, I like baseball. Baseball's dope. I don't like football. Fucking hate football with a passion. As in, don't even fucking bring up football to me. Because <laughs> I don't like to talk about it. Alright. <clears throat> if you guys can't... Fuck. <clears throat> Who? <clears throat> if you guys can't tell from this fucking fantastic handwriting, this is from a girl. <laughs> named Emma from Oregon. You can always tell big difference between <laughs> guys' handwriting and girls every time. <clears throat> Make sure that's it. That is it. All right. Oh shit. Money. Uh, dear Subi, I'm a 17-year-old girl, haven't been watching your channel that long, but Motonosity directed me over a few months ago, and I've been watching ever since. Shouts out to Motonosity. That big fucking jacked guy. <laughs> I gotta say, you're a huge inspiration to me because of what you do, and I just think you're the shit, man. Keep cranking out the quality videos. I included the money because I just want to support the channel and what you do. Not really a I give you money, send me stuff sort of deal. I've had a job for about 10 months now and I'm still nowhere near close to buying a bike, but when I do, I'm hoping to get a Yamaha WR250. Thoughts on that? Anyway, keep up the rad work, man. Sending you my good vibes. Emma Flowers. At Flowers Emma on Instagram. Everyone, pull out your fucking phones now and see what she looks like, cause she's a girl. Isn't that the normal thing to do right there? Anyways, um, WR250. Fucking fantastic bike. I don't... <coughs> <laughs> Whenever people <clears throat> that are like, you know, adults or whatever, like, obviously if you're like 13 or something, you don't need like a WR250, you can just go get a straight dirt bike because you can't take it on the road anyways. But seeing how you're 17, um, definitely go WR250. Uh, you get the Supermoto, which is like the most fun all around bike you could have. It's not a 450, so you're not going to like fucking kill yourself. But the 250 definitely have, has enough there to have fun. If I could have a second, like, Supermoto, it'd probably be a, well, I don't know. I would definitely get a WR250, though. Like, I would, I have nothing against the bike. The only problem is, is just, like, it's not a 450, and that's not really even a problem. If I could have a WR250 stunt bike also, I would be all fucking about it. So, I, yeah, fuck, why don't you, <laughs> I don't think, I don't remember if, Motonosity sold his bike yet or not? His WR250 had? I don't know. I haven't seen. I haven't really been like in the loop of everything. But buy his. <laughs> make him make him sell to you. Or Fry Riding, he's got a WR250 as well that's for sale. Except his isn't near as nice looking as uh Motonosity's was. <laughs> Which sucks. Just kidding, Fry. I love you. Um so yeah, Emma. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. I'll take this as like a, a Patreon type thing. <laughs> and that this five will go towards Patreon stuff. And if you guys aren't part of the Patreon, um, we've gotten the live hangout things figured out. And pretty much if you donate, you can tell me what to do with the money. Things we've discussed so far are like a second dirt bike. Like just straight dirt bikes. So I can go like tracks and trails and shit a lot more often. Um, what else? We've talked about like gear or just random trips and stuff. Like I'm going to California soon, like I said. So Patreon money helping those kind of things out would be really nice. I could do more of them. But yeah, just stuff like that. So yeah, if you guys want to join the Patreon, that's cool. If not, that is perfectly fine too. You guys can just sit back and watch what happens with the Patreon money and enjoy it the same. Um, <clears throat> that's it for like the hand written letters or hand typed like Emma did. Um, next is packages and stuff. <coughs> um, <clears throat> so some of these, honestly I have no idea what some of these, one of these I do know what it is, but 
Oh, actually this one too, I'm sorry. I know what two of these are. I'm fucking lying. This one is from Ashley, or as you guys may or may not know her, Spee's Knees. S-P-E-E-S-K-N-E-E-S. Yes, she's a chick. She rides motorcycles. Isn't that what you guys love? Uh, but yeah, she was uh, up here not too long ago. Or down here, I'll say. They're from fucking Canada, so. She was down here, so yeah. Ashley, cool chick. You guys should go give her a subscribe and all that. I'm fucking struggling here with this knife. <clears throat> That's right, I got a one-off. Make sure nothing else is in here. Fucking trash. That's right, got some dope stickers. Those are cool. Yep, those are cool. Those are. I wish I had shit that cool, but I don't. And a fucking Spee's Knees baseball jersey. You can probably see my nipples through this. Wet t-shirt contest? I think so. But yeah, I knew I knew I was getting this, guys. But it's still cool. Um, definitely go give her channel a subscribe. She puts out videos quite frequently. So, cool chick. She's dope. <clears throat> go give her a subscribe. What's next? This one is from <clears throat> uh, Kappa Mira from <laughs> New Jersey. I probably butcher like everyone's fucking, oh, that's convenient. Like everyone's names. Oh shit. T-shirt. I'm sure nothing else is in, oh. <laughs> Plenty more in here. Make sure that's it. <clears throat> Let's see here, we got some stickers. Those are, I like that. Subi, I've been a big fan from the start and wanted to show you my appreciation by sending you a shirt I made to promote my own YouTube channel. Hope the Grom is okay. Uh, try to keep that thing right side up more often. Dude, no kidding. Ride safe and please don't shave that beard. I'm trying real hard to learn how to wheelie but failing miserably. One day I'll get it. <laughs> it definitely takes practice. I've uh, been riding bikes my whole life so don't think the wheelies just happen overnight. I think that's what a lot of people just assume that like I hop on a bike and can instantly do it and that's not the case at all. At all. Ugh. What? It's a fucking grunt, dude. That's dope. Yeah, I'll definitely rock this fucking shirt. That's funny. Dope. I actually got my grom. My grom's working. I just need to change the oil in it and then... You know, it's ready to keep hitting the streets. I haven't really gotten a chance to ride it too much just because every time lately I've had free time and like I was gonna go ride in that free time, it's been like I need to go out and ride on my WR. And then like I went out of town, I had like just little shit coming up and you know, all that kind of stuff. So, you know, hopefully I'll get out and ride the Grom probably, probably this week, maybe even today, I don't know, we'll see. Yeah, I gotta go pick up my MacBook from... That's right, I got a fucking iMac and a MacBook. So I'm a fuckboy like that. Um, but my MacBook crashed. As you guys remember, I finally went and got it fixed. The hard drive had to get replaced. So, that's what they're doing. I'll open this one last. This one's from JJ Palma. Another very uh, recognizable name. Frequent, frequent, uh, like... What's the word I'm looking for? Somebody who frequently comments on shit? <laughs> oh shit, fucking hats, dude. Hell yeah. <laughs> I got some penis gummies. Oh shit. <clears throat> All right. Let's open the letter first. Dear Subi Freaking Moto, I joined the Subi Subscribe Club in the sub 20k range. I was still, or I was and still am, very impressed with your wheelie skills and your rather daring driving habits in the DFW area. I definitely saw the potential in your abilities and the affinity people would have for you. The affinity. I feel like I'm pronouncing it wrong. I don't know. Sounds weird in my head. 
I'm pretty proud of you for your success. I really appreciate that. It's great to see you see a local guy such as yourself do well. Appreciate you sharing one of your passions with us. I don't even see where he's from. I fucked up. I mean, apparently he's from fucking here. Oh, he's from Carrollton, represent. Anyways, I thought it'd be pretty sick if you could get in the Guinness World Record book for the longest wheelie. I did a uh, can't talk right now. I did a little research and discovered that the current record is 205.7 miles. No big deal, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm like 200 and you know like 200 miles short of that. No big deal. I was hoping it was in the mile or so range. Obviously, I was a bit naive, but hey, it is a decent goal to strive towards, right? I've included three items. One of them is just for laughs. Remember your Facebook post about the guy in a lifted truck that cut you off and then proceeded to harass you. So I included something that would be appropriate for such individuals that may cross your path again. The other two items are for your enjoyment. Sincerely, JJ Palma. <clears throat> Penis gummies. <laughs> I don't know. Part of me wants to eat these because I fucking love gummy candy. And the other part of me is like... Don't eat the gummy dicks. Don't eat the gummy dicks. <laughs> Fuck. I'm probably gonna eat the gummy dicks. Let's be real. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit for real. Ooh. No Shave Life, Beard Company. And that's me. <laughs> I wear hats like every single day of my life, guys, so. Hats are great. I can never have too many hats. Ugh. This one's childproof. Fucking childproof. Oh, hell yeah. I'm really glad you decided to send snapbacks because snapbacks are my fucking shit. This is dope. Y'all my hat, no shave life beard, company, hat. These are fucking, these are the tits. I really like these. Thank you. Thank you. Hell yeah. I'm really excited for the hats. <laughs> All right, so this last one, uh, just because I read who it's from, I know it's in here. And this company has decided to give me some stuff to give away to you guys. And so, if, uh, my this knife, it was my work knife, but it's like falling apart and it's all fucking broken and shit. And it obviously isn't that sharp. But anyways, <laughs> um, this company called Through Night, they contacted me and wanted to send me some stuff that they thought that I could use, and I think that I can use it too. This one, damn, check out the packaging. It's kind of fancy. Fancier than I was expecting. Um, anyways, they sent me this headlamp. Just because, as you guys know, and we all fucking know, like, <laughs> when we're out riding, we end up in tunnels a lot. And inside the tunnels, like, you guys don't see it, but we typically do end up stopping inside the tunnels for extended periods of time. Or when we're out night riding, we don't always have the bikes on, and flashlights, we use them a lot. Um, so through night, they sent me... Obviously, I got to... Uh, Put batteries and shit in it but yeah they sent me this head this uh headlamp you know stick it up on your head like my gopro is right now um they sent me one of these and then they're also sending me two just regular flashlights and i will you know whenever i actually put these to use i will tell you guys how they fucking work how good they are or how shitty they are just judging by the quality of this, it feels like it's going to be pretty fucking bitching. But yeah, so they're sending me this one, they sent me this one, and then they're sending me two more. And that means you guys will get one. So whenever I get those in the mail, and I do the full run through of them all, and I do their video for them, uh, yeah, you guys can win one of them. And these are pretty nice flashlights, actually. Um, <clears throat> 
But yeah, if you, uh, or if you're trying to like check out these, uh, check these out for yourself, like online, you can go to their website. It's throughnight.com, I do believe. Um, yeah, throughnight.com, I was right. Uh, but yeah, I've been in contact with them for, you know, a little bit. So hopefully I'll get to put this to good use here very soon. And even though like, I actually use these at work a lot just because of, uh, whenever I start work, it's still like dark out. I, we work early <laughs> and late. So I'm actually really excited to put that to use and it definitely going to get used while we're fucking riding because we're typically riding past dark. You guys just don't get to always see everything that goes into it. So that'll be out soon. Um, everyone that sent me stuff, thank you. I really appreciate it. Um, you know, I, yeah, mail videos, they're fucking cool. I like it. I like seeing where you guys are from and reading all the stuff, opening packages, getting stuff like this, getting people involved to where I can do giveaways with stuff. You know, shit's dope. Very dope. So, other than that, I think that is the conclusion of this mail video. So, again, thank you everybody, and we'll see you on the next one.